It was the harshest performance review I've ever given. In the few short months since I promoted him, he had managed to alienate the entire team. I'd met with a parade of his direct reports over the last few weeks, each threatening to quit. I should have seen it coming. He was a superstar in his job, a product of the Ivy League and a Rhodes Scholar. He was supernova smart, a brain so fast it was scary. So I promoted him to lead his peers. It was a disaster from day one. He had no patience for anything, berated anyone and everyone, even had an ugly misogyny streak. All of my coaching had fallen on his deaf ears. I had no choice but to move him back to individual contributor. Both his review and my note to the VP of HR said, quote, this person should never be allowed to manage people again. Imagine my shock when a couple of years later he was on the cover of the business press as the wonderkind, likely next CEO.